hold out to win to to go back ahead, and all he did was uh, yeah. just pulled it back in. Yeah, that was in that was at Worlds. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we're starting the so this is the finals. This is the finals. The first game of the finals. Uh, ben Furlan has to beat. <laughs> ben Furlan has to beat Andy twice. Andy is king of the hill. Um. Andy seems to be. He looks a little better now. Ben's gonna have to thumb the. Okay. Uh, Ben's gonna have to thumb this. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because i kind of been here all afternoon. Yeah. You got it. So I did notice Ben has the one, he does have the one bird, right? Or the yes, one iron. Yes, right. That is. For this whole, so they're playing this, uh, yeah, they just played this course. Or he just played this course. Uh, yes. Because we were talking about the the fact that he had that one bird for that one for a whole five. A Andy's looking a little sharper here. I think uh, we're not seeing as much tongue yet, so we'll see. He still uh, looks no, a little dazed. I mean, he's still out there, but high T right here. All right. Mm -hmm. But Ben could do this. Like he could beat him twice in the state that Andy's in. Like, and maybe like. It, maybe if Andy wasn't in the state that he was in, I think that he could probably because Ben's a good, he's a great player. Yeah, he really is. I mean, I played him. This is a good look right here. I actually played him early in the tournament, and I beat him. Like it wasn't even close. Okay, uh, I lied. Just it, come, just only come beat him by short. one. But. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think he's going to thumb this. I was going to say this is not a bad look at all. He really needs to thumb this. Good shot. Mm -hmm. Again, so. shout out to Sidelines. You guys, they've been doing a great job here. We're wrapping it up. Steve, Russ, mm -hmm. Paige. Big time. All those guys have done a great job. They're just calling great Jason job. and Nate Stowell. That's going to be the loser bracket finals. Mm -hmm. So I guess Jason must have beat Art DeVries. Yeah. So um, I well, so does that mean that they're going to wait till the this this one's over and they, they they'll do the women's? I hope so. After? Yeah. I'm actually looking forward to that. So Ben Again, coming I up just a little short there, but he's not in trouble. Oh really? Okay. Okay, good. Wow, I can't believe good. that there are that many left. I got to play some a few men. Oh oh wow yeah okay. So Andy, good shot, in good place right there. Uh, Ben's gonna have to kind of go around this one, but it's not a hard shot. Good shot. Oh, I think he's gonna thumb. Yeah, that's that's it right there. He pushed it. He pushed it left. And as we mentioned earlier, his thumbs are insured for three million. Yeah, three million. Yeah. Three million. Yeah. That's not a joke either. That is. That is. Now both, as a yeah, it's for both thumbs. So again, I, I why are we stuck on this bird. look? I don't understand this. Why we can't get a different look? I've seen this course. I don't know. I mean, I like seven this times a day. I like this look for match play because there's no. I'm some, not. I'm not know, disagreeing. Other looks are like, okay, but it'll be. It up I'd more. like to see different looks on some of the other holes. Yeah, I agree with that. Oh, I thought he had the one he bird. Use the one bird there. Yeah, that's not. Ooh. Definitely, if you have the one bird, that's the that this is the hole that. Oh, he's got the one bird too. What the hell? Yeah, this is gonna be. This should be close. Yeah, I mean that's perfect. It's. I don't understand why Ben didn't hit that. That's why you put the that club in your bag for this course. Like you don't have that on any other course. Right. right. Um. Maybe he's a little flustered. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it how it progressive progresses. But <laughs> I 
Um, I can't. I, I can't comment on that because, yeah, yeah, for legal reasons. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to think back, Luna, to my first, the actual first year I played, might mm -hmm. have been, uh, is it China Lagoon? Is that the name of the course? Uh, Pearl Lagoon. Pearl Lagoon. But there was also the other China course was Great Wall. But that was 2010, I believe. All right. Well, that's Pearl too far. That's too far like back. 2014 ish. Why? What's uh, that was that was the first time you played? Uh, that's what team? I'm thinking. Is uh, yeah. what and Sandy Reef was that the same year? S yeah, probably. Sandy right, that, and so Pearl that were both. So that was my first. Those were my. Those Actually, were my first set of courses. I don't know if Sandy was that year. Uh, could have been. But Pearl is one of my favorite all-time courses too. Yeah. I love Sandy too. Actually, Sandy oh, there you go, Mouth. Thank you, huh? thank you, Mouth. Teal Garden. That's the one I could I could never I could yeah, see it in my head. Teal was Japan. I just could not think of the name of the course. Um, was that the same year as, as Sandy Reef? Because I believe that was my first year. S yes, absolutely. Sandy Reef and Teal Gardens was the same year. I think that was my first year, and mm. I couldn't get that Chinese course or Japanese course was the death of me. I I could never ever figure it out. Yeah, Teal was uh, yeah. There were some shots there where, but that, I'm talking brand, for a brand new player, not watching yeah, videos yeah. or you I know mean, you, not you, living with Todd and not knowing the shots. Yeah. I knew nothing. There was a lot of there was a lot of you know obstacles, and, and, Thanks, and sometimes yeah. you had to know where to lay it up. Yeah, 2017. To, to get, so that was that would have been my first year, 2017. 17 was it really? That? Yeah. Okay. I'm still yeah. fairly new, man. I just. <laughs> I, I'm still learning this game. It's just, it's crazy. Yeah, I guess that w that would be right because 2000. Okay. Good shot there by Andy. Mm -hmm. Yep, Juniper Falls. Yep, Pine Coast, Ruby Rock. Juniper Pine. That was it. Yeah. That was that Ruby. was my first year. I I liked I liked Ruby. I thought it was a challenging course. Uh, Juniper. That was uh, Jason Elliott's uh, favorite course of all time. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. I don't know if y'all know Jason. He's uh, Evansville guy. That's a good great shot, shot there. Yep. I guess he could use the one bird there too. Yeah. Shit, maybe keep I'll it below. Put the one bird in my in my bag. Probably not. <laughs> I, <laughs> uh, I believe you've already yeah. won, so yeah. you kind of know what you're doing. You, you <laughs> no, I mean, damn! I should have put the one I bird in my in bag. I got the one more matches. What? How many more matches did you need to win? <laughs> oh. uh, ben overcooked it just a little bit. This might be, yeah. He's got to make this. Oh, he's doing the, okay, so. So, so Ben, okay, so he missed that, but Ben is doing a chipping technique that is new, relatively new to the game, that I've only seen a few people do. Joe Basara is one of them, and he seems to be, like, dead nuts with this with this chipping technique yeah i guess i kind of missed what he just did so it's like a very it's like it's like a, a click or two pullback sometimes just one click pullback right and then you just thumb the just thumb it straight out of it yeah or or what however you pull it back i don't know okay but um, i just know that uh i know joe i know he loves it because he's told me. So, Luna, got a question. This, Jerry Winters wants to know, he struggles with the eight wood, goes long, comes up short. Any suggestions besides getting rid of it? <laughs> I'm sorry, say that again? Eight wood. I struggle with eight wood, go long, come up short. Any suggestions besides getting rid of it? No, actually, I, I'm under, I, I believe that you need either the seven, the eight, or the nine in every single bag that you have for the courses that are presented to us. Um, and I think that the 8-wood is the least volatile of those, the higher lofted woods. And that's what I, I carry the 8-wood. I love the, it. So the 9, like, if you think the 8-wood is crazy, try the 9, and you'll be like, okay, I'm going back to the 8. Uh, 7, I used to use that back in the day. It's I don't really know that much about it. I like the eight wood a lot. 
I only used a nine wood on one course uh, this year. We'll see what happens next year. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. I like, I mean, I like the, the nine wood goes very, very high. So that's a good thing. But it, it can also, I felt like it could get away from me at times. Right. Like I would, I would hit it hard and they would just soar, you know. So that's the one thing I liked about, and Mouth did this not too long ago, is when, mm -hmm. uh, yep, and he's talking about it now. The nine wood, the seven, eight, and nine wood, I'm, I'll never forget it, watching his video of how close mm -hmm. almost all three of those clubs distance-wise oh, yeah, were, were within three to six yards. So honestly, for distance-wise, well, it, it really wasn't that big a deal. But for height, yeah. now height distance, Obviously, the nine's going to go higher, the eight not so much, and then the seven not so much. Like he did fulls, right? Did, didn't he do fulls in that in that uh, in that test where he was like trying to see where mm -hmm. where each one would land up? And yeah, it was like two yards. Yeah, like two yards there, two, two yards. Yep, it was eight, awesome. Two, and then yeah. So shout out to Mouth for that. That was that was one of the best videos really I've cool. seen. Um. So, I mean, I don't know. I, I it's still just preference, you know. A lot of people use nine wood. Like I would use it. I'm just I'm so used to the eight wood. Yeah, the nine bird is pretty much a replacement of the six iron, but there's still guys that still carry the six iron instead of the nine bird. Um, I guess it's personal preference of what you want to carry. The nine. Wait, what do you mean? The nine, nine hybrid one? and the six iron, pretty much the same. Pretty much the same club. Oh, I didn't. I don't. Ha I don't know. I don't know anything about that. So this was drivable here. I didn't here. use the nine bird at all. Actually, maybe I did bet when it started. Oh, and he's gonna have a long putt here. Should be should be straight up. I don't up, think though. he's happy with his uh, with his shot. We'll see if Ben. This is not this. Yeah, this ain't. This is not too bad of a look. Yeah, the tree's the tree is not an issue at this all. Is a very slight cut, and then missed those. Ooh, well, he hammered that. Okay, he's gonna have a chip. So Andy, straight Look. up. Man, he's good. Mm -hmm. So I think Andy may have bounced back a little bit. Uh, he didn't so look this, nearly as. So this this is the. Ch yeah, it looks like he is doing it. Yeah, he's. Two he's clicks. Doing, he's doing the same. And look how hard he thumbs it, yeah. Wow. All right, so that was a two clicker. That was too close. With the hybrid, with the with five the hybrid. hybrid. Yeah. Yeah, that's – I haven't messed with it. I – you know, I probably should just because, you know, Joe knows what he's talking about. Absolutely. Like not, like, if, if somebody's going to know what they're doing, then Joe's a good one to go to. Maybe I'm just – yeah, I just – I don't know. Maybe I'm waiting for new shit to come out. <laughs> <laughs> this so there's, that's a good – there's a good question, Paul. So, I mean, yeah. you've been playing – you've been playing – and it was on. This is something I just thought about. Mm -hmm. You've been playing tee for quite a long time. Is, yeah. are, do you still learn from other uh, from other guys? Yes, absolutely. That's the whole. That's the whole thing about golden tee. Like you have to. You have to learn every single time that you play, and with play with someone new. You know. I always learn. Like, you no, know, any tournament that I go to, I probably learn something new. Now, whether or not I implicate it, you know, into my own game is another story. Right. You know, because sometimes I might not be, not, might not be comfortable with it, but, but yeah, I do. I'm like, okay, so you can go there or you can hit this shot. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's like, I mean, obviously, the in intricacies of golden tee are significantly less right. than real golf. But I think that the, you know, the old saying is still true. You know, it takes, it takes, what is it? A lifetime to, if you fool me once, you can't, you know, you, ain't, you fool me. You know, I'm not going to get fooled again. Right. That was a George W. Bush quote. I don't know. I forgot where I was going with that. I'm a little <laughs> drunk right now. I was going to say, apologize. I was trying to follow you and so, trying to help uh, you out, but uh, <laughs> I, I couldn't follow you. No, uh, what were we talking about? I forgot. 
Just learning from other players. So, like this weekend, I, yeah, I no, taught. So yeah. the left, there's a shot on um, hidden, and it, it was a hole that you said you'd like to think. You know, you'd like to see a drivable. Remember? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you ever play to that left side? Because I taught some guys that shot this weekend too. Yeah, and we the guys talk are like, about that. They're like, where, um, where are you going? I, I'm like, I'm going over here to the left because the wind, and I have the whole green to work with. Do you know what I'm talking about? That left side. Yeah. No, absolutely. I that was. Uh, that was, uh, we actually talked about that as well um, in the other commentary. Yeah. Um, I don't usually go there. I mean, it really depends. Like, if the pin is at the bottom, then I do like to go there sometimes if it's a tailwind mm -hmm. or if it's a headwind because you can kind of, because a lot of times with bite, it will check up too much. Right. Right, so you don't get a lot of play, and you, you, can't, you can't really r r like run out. Ooh, Ooh wow, that was uh, really close right there. Oh, and he might be feeling the pressure here. Or he's feeling something. Or perhaps he's wondering why someone would shoot a man <laughs> before throwing him out of a plane. Now, is this drivable for him? Three seventy-five. No, he's laying up here for sure. With the thirteen, seven and a half. What the fuck is he doing? He's. That's what I'm asking. He didn't put the high, or did he? That is not. Oh my god! I'm sorry. I hit, I said the f word, but I just could not believe that he was doing that shot. Now, now, in my defense, we can't see the uh, the height of the T because the their player. I was say the, their player, that the, picture is way yeah, bigger. It's in than the way. So I thought he was hitting a medium tee, but he, I think he did hit high. He just didn't hit it hard enough. Let's see if. Well, um, we can. I can kind of watch the tee. Watch the actual tee. So here, I actually, I like the, I like. Right, that. That's the medium tee. Okay, that's a medium tee. Yeah, he's laying there. All right. Uh, so he's gonna try to hole out. If he holds it out and Andy doesn't, they're tied. Yeah. This is pretty much the perfect. This is the perfect scenario for him to hole out. He's got to thumb it out a little bit to the right. Uh, I probably would know. This is going to come in really close. I would have let it go, especially with those the, the shot. plus irons. You got to let it go there. You know, you're trying to hold out. And Andy's doing the smart thing and putting bite on it because, like, that can that sand wedge can get away from you. Wow, It'll, good shot. Yeah, I mean. So Andy, you were asked to check your uh, messages. Me? Nope. Oh, yeah. Nope. Never mind. So we got 360. Oh, here. See, why did he play the one? He does have the one bird. Why did he play the one bird on five? I'm still. I'm still. I I don't know. I mean, that's that's where you want to play it. If you have if you have it in your bag, that's where you want to play. The I don't one bird. understand why he didn't. And he do played that. it the the match before. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And, I don't. And he knew that was. I mean, I don't know. Maybe he just got flustered. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure that one but out. That's the game right there. I mean, that's they're they're tied if he, you know, if he eagles that and you know, but you know, anything can happen. Yep. So he needs to make up two here this somewhere. Actually, he's got a good chance here cuz he got the plot. Okay. He didn't. I think Ian's going to turn one. No, he's not. He's just going to hammer it. All right, so Andy's up one. We're going into 17. I think he's up uh, two, isn't he? Uh, he's no, up just one. one. All right. Let's see if we get a tough look. No, it's an easy look. It's a right four, but it's still, uh, it's still an up seven. I, th I feel like. Uh, Can we talk about why Ben just laid up on both those holes? I, I don't know. I, laid that's up what, on what? What do you mean? Well, he could have drove. I mean, Andy just, if he high teed like that last here. hole, he, he was there. That yeah, the, last hole. No, the, well, the la yeah, 16 was not was not drivable. I didn't think 16 was either. No. But 15, definitely, he could have gotten there. So I don't like the plus irons on, I mean. On well, I don't know, and there's ever, I don't know that there's ever a shot that I'm ever putting bite on this, on the screen. I mean, there, there are I'll some. I'll put the release or some places. Nothing, just but like, 
but the but with the plus irons and with the up eight, like you're okay. I think this is uh, Jazz is saying so it was definitely so drivable at 360. Well, we, we kind of missed that, so anyway, I don't, I don't know what the head, I don't know what the wind was, but I mean, where's that pin? I can't see where the pin is. Can you ask them to turn like some <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, so can you go can see the pin? turn back to the right? Keep going, that way we know if it's a good yeah. shot or not. Yeah. Nice, easy. He's not going to show. All right, so either. the pin oh. looks like it's on the bottom. It's on the bottom. Oh, I wonder if he's going to go after this. He's going to nut this. This is. But at the same time, he's still pointed. He is still. The wind is still pointing to the left, mm -hmm. which is why that's not like a terrible shot because it'll still bring it back over because he's going to have to hit that out to the right. The trees are going to be in the way for Andy. Uh, I think Ben hit Ben hit the correct shot here. This is this is where you want to be. Oh, we just got to put the stick right in the middle of the green and just so like that's that. That's an eagle right there for him. Yeah, it's going to offset him. Let's see, it's going to turn him. He he's he's still, yeah, you just got to throw this out to the right a little bit I with the one bird. Why is he hitting this? Why is he hitting this? Well, that's why because he's Andy. <laughs> <laughs> so you better make that. I'm sorry. I, I cussed again. I cancel that. Uh, and he got it. That's, that's it. That's to be the game right there, boys. Well, uh, and Andy Haas, he's done it. He nice wins job. Nice job, Andy. The 2022 Florida Open.